guys, today I am so excited because I have a fall video for you. I'm going to be showing you how to make these Hershey's Kisses acorn treats. Last year I made something similar to these using donut holes. If you guys are interested in watching that video, I will link it below. My mom found this idea on, I think, Facebook, and when she showed it to me, I was super excited because I love anything that has to do with fall. So for this, you are going to need some mini Nilla wafers. I've also seen people using the little mini, I think they're called mini Nutter Butters or something like that. Some Hershey's Kisses. I, of course, got the ones in the fall packaging. You are going to need some type of baking chips. I am using peanut butter because I like the color of these. You could also use chocolate chips or butterscotch. Some Nutella, which is my favorite, or if you don't like Nutella, you can also use any type of frosting. And then, of course, you have to have an adorable fall plate to place your treats on. So the first thing I like to do before I begin is unwrap all of my Hershey Kisses. That way you don't have to unwrap them as you go. It just saves you a lot of time and makes it go a lot faster. And now on to making the acorns. So you're going to take one of your mini Nilla wafers and some of your Nutella or frosting, and you're just going to dab a little bit on the wafer. I just like to put a little bit in the middle. And then you're just going to take your Hershey Kiss and stick it right onto it. So this is what your acorn is going to look like so far. I'm just going to set this one aside and then do the rest of them. If you wanted to, you could add the top pieces to these now, but I just like to go ahead and do these two steps first. That way the Nutella has time to harden up before I add the top piece and then the wafer isn't sliding all over the place. Once I have all of these made up, I'm just going to stick mine in the fridge for about 5 or 10 minutes to help them harden up faster. Now we're going to add the top pieces, so you're just going to take your baking chip and then again you're just going to dab a little bit of your Nutella or frosting on that. And then you're just going to stick it as close as possible in the center of your acorn. They don't have to be perfect because obviously acorns in nature are not perfect, so they don't have to be perfect. They're going to look cute no matter what. So then you're just going to go ahead and repeat the process until all of your acorns are finished. Here are the finished acorns. These things are so adorable and they are so delicious, you guys, but I warn you, they are very addicting. These also go great with hot chocolate or coffee. If you pop one of these things in your mouth and then take a drink of hot chocolate or coffee, oh my gosh, they just melt right in your mouth and they taste amazing.